Then we have vitamin D. I'm guessing tractors are usually very slow. This is very hard for me. Oh my god, there's so many cows. Get this for free. Hey guys, I'm Isa, and today we're going to be reviewing Dairy Craft by Blockwork. So this is actually a free map. So you can go to the marketplace and you can just get this for free. And don't forget to sub and step the like on so you don't miss any new posts. Now, let's go. Now we're gonna see just how good of a map it is for free. Okay guys, we are in. And I swear, we're like going into like science class or something, a farmer. Welcome to Dairycraft. As you explore our world, you'll learn all about milk, where it comes from and how it's made and what you can do with it. We have three activities for you on this farm. Talk to my friends to start your journey. Did you know milk is used to make all kinds of different foods? The lesson will take you where the processing plant where you can make ice cream. Yee! I didn't even bother to read the rest. Hang on, nutrients in the body. I'm gonna do this. Oh, whoa, oh, oh. whoa. Gather information about the 15 essential nutrients within milk. Find all 15 chests inside the house and read the nutrient info. Welcome to my farmhouse. We're lucky to live on a farm because milk provides us with so many nutrients needed for a healthy diet. 15, in fact. Can you find those 15 nutrients around the house? Read the information booklet about each nutrient and pick up the foods which provide an alternative source to the milk. All right, let's look. Oh. Butter. Ice cream. Yay. I want me ice cream. Can I, eat the, I can just straight up eat the butter. All right, Nissian. Helps with normal growth and conversion of food into energy and tissue formation, including bones. All right. Thymin? Releases energy from carbohydrates and helps normal brain growth and development. Carbohydrates <laughs> are like grains, like your bread, your pasta, stuff like that. And you can get it from bread, tomato, and carrots. All righty. Let me look around and see what else. Oh, Akam and Jenny. There's tiny kids. Oh, I almost missed this. What is this? More butter. Wait, was I supposed to keep the ingredients? I hope not. Vitamin B12. It helps with red blood cell formation. Okay, 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 okay. <laughs> I'm gonna put the butter in my inventory this time. Chez. We got chez this time. More chess. Vitamin A. All right, let's read what we got now. So, Penthon. Why are vitamins so hard to say? Panthonic acid. Factor in conversion of food into energy and tissue formation, including bones. I have such trouble. And then vitamin A helps with bone development, with bone and tooth development. Also helps maintain night vision and healthy skin other sorts of okay yeah we, we we don't have to read that i love milk possibly a little too much so i definitely have all of these zinc the first thing i've ever seen that's easy to say <laughs> factor in tissue formation including bones and conversion of food into energy all right more yogurt calcium helps with the formation of maintenance of strong bones and healthy teeth one glass of milk provides the equivalent calcium of 365 grams of broccoli. That's a lot of broccoli. <laughs> I don't know how much that is. I'm just gonna take a guess that that's a lot. All right, we have chess, more chess. Protein, this helps build and repair body tissues, including muscles and bones, and plays a role in the creation of antibodies, which fight infection. One glass of milk provides the equivalent protein of one egg. Yeah, I definitely have a lot of that, huh? <laughs> then we have vitamin D. Enhances calcium and phosphorus absorption. Phosphorus, on which strong bones and teeth depend. All right, let me just, all right, five more to, or no, not five more. We have six more to go. There's an upstairs, I think? Oh no, what is this? Cream, just straight up cream, okay. Selenium. This sounds like an easy one, but it's not. Selenium. 
Factor in the correct functioning of the immune system due to antioxidant effect. This is very hard for me. It's, I can barely say some of these words. Can I just? I can't break your window. Okay. <laughs> I think you guys know I break a lot of windows to move around. Oh, so that was like literally right next to it. I'm pretty sure I have 10 of them, so I need five more. Where the heck would they be? The farm, oh, there is an upstairs. How was I so blind? All right, there is normal, just straight up milk in this bucket. We have phosphorus. Factor in the formation and maintenance of strong bones and teeth. One glass of milk provides the equivalent phosphorus of three slices of whole wheat bread. Yeah, milk is very, very good for us. I can already tell by a lot that it's very, very good. And one glass can help you so much. All right, potassium. Helps with the correct functioning of nerves and muscles. One glass of milk provides the equivalent potassium of one small banana. So you guys have had bananas before, right? Obviously. So that's sort of what it would do. Magnesium. They're getting easier. A factor in bone and teeth health. It helps to convert food into energy and tissue formation. All right, I think we're almost done. Uh, that is 13, there's two more left. Vitamin B6. Factor in the conversion of food into energy and tissue formation, including bones. All right, I'm surprised I missed that. So now I'm gonna check all the chests I pass. Oh, I think I missed this one. Yep, I missed this one. All right, riboflavin. Riboflavin is a is a factor in the conversion of food into energy and tissue formation. All right. So we have five. We got all of them. We only were we were only missing one. All right, I'm done. Nicely done. Now go back to the deck and speak to. Go back to the back of the house and speak to Jenny and Akim. All right, Jenny. So you think you're a nutrient expert? When we're working on the farm at night, it really helps to have good night vision. Can you tell me what? <laughs> Use a milk boost that should help your night vision if you ever need it. I'm super strong for my age, which is just as well because farmers need to do to be super strong to do all the heavy work we do. Protein's pretty useful for helping me with my strength. Can you guess which one of these is a good source of protein? Oh wait, I'm gonna actually see if I can do it on my own. <laughs> yep, I'm gonna just spin. <laughs> it was cheese! The silos. Hello? Hi there, sir who Akam sent to hell. I hope you're up to the task. We need to get these 25 hay, hay bales into the silo, but the ladders are broken off. You need to jump to get to the top, and these milk booths might help you out. Alright. Ooh, we got some parkour. Parkour will be kicking in. I'm gonna see if I don't need the jump post until later. Boast. I don't need the jump post. I don't need the jump post until later. Possibly I might need it now. I know I don't. Just be careful. Do I actually have to? I have to do a Neo jump on. Oh my god, the game's actually gonna make me do like a Neo jump on trap doors! I hate those. Alright, can we get in now? I just thought I have to go this way. Nice work, nearly as fast as me. I hope you've got the hay bales. You need to jump in through the top of the silo and place all 25 hay bales in there. It's quite dark in there. If you still have the night vision boost from Jenny, now will be the time to use it. Woo! It is dark. All right. Hay bales, 25. I was about to be like, is this actually 29 hay bales? Yeah, it is. Got 25, not 20. Congratulations, you completed the activity. Vroom, vroom! 
Oh, I'm back out. All right, let's talk to on the farm now. <laughs> Have you ever wanted to know what a daily farmer does all day? Click on the button below to experience a day in the life of a farmer. Then try building your own farm. Oh my God, there's so many cows. Veterinarian. I provide healthcare for the cows. I may have to provide emergency care, such as surgery, as well as vaccinations and preventive health care. All right, that's one. How am I gonna get out of with all these cows? Um, am I a cow now? Moo? How do I get out? Is there a gate? Yeah, there's a gate. All right. This isn't the farmer right here. I can't talk to him for some reason, so let me just go in the bath. Cows choose when they want to be milked and come to these machines. They are given food while being milked and exit while the, when the milking is complete. Farmer. Working with animals every day is amazing and can be messy. The barn is where cows live and needs to be cleaned daily to make sure they have a healthy and hygienic environment. So that's three. The daily nutritionist is something I'm probably gonna have to talk to. Milk house. I give recommendations to the farmer on cattle feed. This is essential in maintaining good milk production and decreasing any health problems for the cows. You might also be interested in where the farmers live. Head out to the farmhouse to find more. I did. Office and control room. Okay. It's my job to visit farms and make sure quality and safety guidelines are followed. So I think that's five. Salesperson. I travel to farms to sell products. To sell and provide information about products. These products could be farm tools or or machinery. I think that might have been a typo. Like you can see here in the drive shed. Have you spoken to online workers? If so, I have keys for this track. I have a key for this tractor. Follow the compass meter to the pa pasture fields behind the barn. All right. He wants me to do it. I'ma do it. Well, the silo is right here. Okay then, I'm gonna do all the tasks. Hey Ava. These are the silos. Silos are airtight towers used to store animal feed. They store large amounts of grain and keep it protected from winds and rain. All right, let me follow this compass now. Is this meant to be the cornfield? If so, ooh, that's a lot of corn or wheat, so let's say break. Yeah, you're who I need to talk to. This is the corn farm, the crop farm. We grow lots of corn and hay for our cows. This machine here is a baler. We use that to cut crops and compress into compact bales, which are easily to handle, transport, and store. Once we've collected the crops, we store them in the silo. Why don't you head there next? Oh, congratulations, you've spoken to everyone on the farm. As a result, here's the key to this tractor. Right click the tractor with the key, and then right click on the tractor again to enter and start driving. It's so slow! It's slow! I'm guessing tractors are usually very slow. Hang on, let me talk to this farmer and see if he has anything new to say. No. I don't want to take the tractor, but I guess we're gonna take it. Vroom vroom. Let me follow the compass and see where it goes. I think I have to talk to this dude again. Finally, some help. I need you to bring seven cows in, in this field to the barn. Not just any cows, I need one of each breed. Use the guidebook in the chest to find out more about the breeds and use the leads from the chest to help the cows back to the red pen in the barn. All right, so I'm gonna just go ahead and grab them all. <laughs> See you later, farmer. Yay! <laughs> one. Two. Come on, you guys. 
Let's get going. I'm gonna need you. Come here, boy. This is gonna be a bit difficult because I don't wanna accidentally get the wrong house. I think you might be one. All right, I got the three cows, and I'm gonna just bring them in. Yeah, man. That was only three. What else do I need? You're gonna see. I don't see any of them. Okay, I found a jersey. I need a gear in a sea. A black one would be a Canadian knee. Milking short horn, I found that. I sure I found that. And brown Swiss, I think I found that. All right, let me look for the other ones. So we need a bright brown. All right, there's one. There's a bright brown. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go 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 go. This is a really dark one. I think that might be a Canadian. <laughs> Canadian. Come here, boy. Oh, I just want to pass him. Where is he? Come here! <laughs> Alright, that's another two. We need one more. Make sure, close. Make sure they get in. Wait, let me get in creative mode. Don't know which one I'm missing, however. Hang on, I think I have an idea. What if I were to just go in the pen and spawn the different kinds? Then maybe I'll be able to complete it faster. Also, I'm releasing you. You are free to roam. All right, so are these the different kinds? Cows, yep. One, two, three, four. Oh, that's it, I did it. Now that all the cows are back in the barn, there's nothing else to help with on this farm. If you have time, try building your own farm on a spare plot. And I had a lot of fun. I honestly liked it, knowing how much that my milk helps me, that I drink a lot. So yeah, I honestly think this is a pretty good map for being a free map. Of course, it's one of those educational ones, which is always good. Well, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video here. And don't forget to sub and hit that bell icon so you don't miss any new posts. And don't forget to take a look at my other channel, Isis World. I'll see you guys next time. Bye! Punch, punch, punch the air.